Hey guys, The Ultimate Filmer here and welcome back to another video and today we're going to be talking about lookup tables, more commonly known as LUTs, and split toning. So the first thing we're going to do, as you might have guessed, is go right into PowerDirector and get started. Green screen. Okay, so once you're in PowerDirector and you have your clip in the timeline, we're just going to go ahead and select it. Click on Fix Enhance. And so first we're going to start with a LUT. So down here you see lookup table in the Enhance tab. We're going to click on that and checkbox it. So if you haven't already downloaded some LUTs, you're going to have to go do that. They're usually .cube files. So I already have, and so I'm going to click Browse right here. And I have seven right here. So this is the one I have chosen, so we're going to double click on that. And now as you see, the LUT has been applied. If I just turn up the quality a bit. So now if we uncheck and check this, you can see the difference without it and with it. So for now we're going to take that off because you've already seen the result and we are going to go and do some split toning. So we're going to click on split toning, we're going to check it. As you see there's shadows and there's highlights. So we're going to start with the shadows and we are going to make them uh, like sort of blue turquoise. Almost. Not so good. So, highlights now, and we're going to make some warm highlights. And after that's done, you can adjust the intensity or the saturation. But this is what happens when you do too much, and then it just looks bad. Yeah, you don't want that. So we're going to turn those both way down, so they just match the look we're going for. And as you see, it's very similar to the lookup table except the LUT just holds a bit more a bit more color variation. So I should have done this before, but we're going to go on to color adjustment and make our normal adjustments like the contrast right here. I'm going to turn that up just a little bit. And now that you're done, I would just add a simple letterbox to make it more cinematic. And then we're all done. So I'm just going to play that intro scene again and you will see the change. So thank you all for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and maybe subscribing if you like. And I'll see you all later. Bye. I was just joking about that subscribing part. You actually have to do that.